Hi everyone! Today I'm here to show you this uh, makeup for Halloween inspired by The Crow and it's a very dark gothic makeup look. So I hope you like it and I leave you to the tutorial. So I started by covering my eyebrows using some prick stick and I helped myself with the wooden tool to really uh, keep them flat against my skin. I put some cello tape in the corners of the eyes and I prepare my eyelids with some primer. This is a um, nice shadow insurance by Too Faced. Now I take that, some black by um, Cryolan from my Supra palette and I'm gonna trace a line um, on my forehead. Um, this is not, um, these are not my eyebrows, it's just a point to understand where I have to stop with my eyeshadow because we're gonna cover this anyway. Now I start my base and I'm using a um, MAC eyeshadow. This is in the color Humid Frost, which is this beautiful green eyeshadow. And I'm applying it with a flat eyeshadow brush from Royal & Langnica. So I bring the eyeshadow eye on the um, eyelid, um, almost under my covered brows. I'm now going to take this shimmery brown from my Sleek palette, also special, with a bullet crease brush and I'm going to apply it over my covered eyebrows. Always from the same palette, I take now this uh, matte black eyeshadow and I'm going to apply it on the top of my covered brows. Here you can do Many, as many layers as you want, depending on the intensity you want to reach. And I think I did about three layers. So we apply the color, and then with the blending brush, we're gonna blend all colors together. This is always a blending brush from Royal and Lagnica. From my screen face palette I'm gonna now take this matte white eyeshadow and I'm gonna apply it um, on the rest of the eye. And now adding on the white part some shimmery pigments from Ben Nye. And I'm gonna intensify even more the black eyeshadow. On the top of the green, I'm gonna go with some pigments by MAC. Uh, I don't remember the name, but they are between blue and uh, golden color. And then I clean my face with the wet wipe and I'm gonna now apply some gel eyeliner. This is a um, black eyeliner from Maybelline, New York. And I'm using a Revlon um, angled brush. So I really um, bring the line out towards my eye. I also put some gel eyeliner inside my waterline and at the bottom of the eye I'm gonna try to do a graphic eyeliner. So I follow the line of my eye and I um, do a parallel line uh, to the upper one. We can extend the line even more towards the temples. 
And now with some white um, and some foundation from uh, Max Factor in the color 100, lasting performance, I'm gonna do a mixture of these two colors and I'm gonna um, start doing my base. I'm using a foundation brush and in the smallest areas I can reach, I'm using a smallest concealer brush. from a palette from Cryolan but this is an aqua color palette so our old color from face and body painting I'm gonna take the black color and I'm gonna paint all my neck in black I'm now going to set my face makeup with um, translucent powder from Ben Nye. And I am blending the eyeshadow, um, sorry, the eyeliner with some black eyeshadow in the corners. Now I'm gonna um, contour a bit my nose with some black eyeshadow and bringing it towards my cheeks and towards my eyebrows. I'm also applying some black eyeshadow um, to contour my cheeks and really blending the color in. Now I curl my eyelashes and I'm gonna apply some mascara and some fake lashes on the top. this wonderful precision ink eyeliner by Illa Masca in the color Scribe which is this wonderful white eyeliner so I'm gonna apply it on the top of my uh, black eyeliner to give this nice contrast black and white I'm now going to apply some uh, rhinestones uh, in the corners of my eyes and some feathers on my neck. And I can't really move at this point. <laughs> I feel like uh, a statue. I'm also going to apply some feathers on the top of my um, eyebrows. I'm now going to take an old teeth brush and some black uh, from my Aquacolor palette uh, Cryolan and I'm going to flick the brush through my face to give this even more textured um, color to the face and I'm, I'm going to add some color on the top of my contouring as well. I'm now defining my lips with a black uh, pencil and I'm gonna fill the, them in with the same color. As a lip 
basic. I'm applying a black uh, cream color uh, from the Kryolan Supra palette. I'm then gonna extend my lips uh, in the corners and trace some lines outwards. Here you have the finished look, I hope you like it, if you do please share my video, give me a thumbs up, comment, subscribe to my channel, everything you like and help me um, to grow as a makeup artist. That was me and my friend. We were laughing in the kitchen because I was pretending to fly and we look like two crazy women. I hope you loved it and thank you for watching. Bye bye.